What's going on guys? Night Warden here, and we are playing Minecraft 1.19 Survival. Yes, we are going to build an amazing world full of quests, lore, and a bunch of interconnected builds. Our goal is to completely, 100% complete this game and explore every aspect and just create a big city and a couple, you know, unique builds, uh, you know, customized locations, uh, you know. My biggest goal, too, is to not die for as long as possible, so I should definitely, uh, probably, definitely should probably go ahead and get started and, uh, you know, start punching a tree, which is kind of the, you know, the first thing you do in Minecraft, everybody knows that, uh, but, uh, yeah, uh, I'm playing, uh, 1.19, uh, this is gonna be on a new YouTube channel, um, and I'm just really gonna be just doing this Let's Play, uh, for as long as possible, um, you know, hopefully I can build an audience, you know, uh, if you are tuning in or if you stumble across this video in the sea of videos on YouTube, uh, go ahead and, you know, think about subscribing, think about liking the video, or just simply watch the video. And tell me what a terrible, terrible YouTuber I absolutely am. Uh, but yeah, no, if you got any tips or suggestions, uh, please let me know. Uh, I'm going to literally just punch this tree. We're going to gather some resources. And our goal for the day, we're going to build our starter house. We're going to build a giant wheat field. Uh, and we're also going to get a cow pin rolling. That is my goal for the day. Hopefully I can do it again without dying. And looks like we got a couple of sheep here, so I guess I will murder you. Come here, sheep. There we go. Get that sheep. Get that other sheep over here. I need more white sheep, actually. Uh, probably enough to make a bed. Uh, I do see that portal. That's kind of a unique little portal. It's literally right next to spawn. There, there we spawned up there. Uh, here's that nether, nether portal there. Uh, we have a cow here. I think I'm actually going to let that cow live. I don't actually want to kill that cow because we're going to want to try and get a cow pen by the end of the episode. So we're going to want to need cows around. I don't really want to have to go to a different location and, you know, you travel 100, 200 blocks transporting, you know, mobs and stuff like that. That's That's not going to be... Not that entertaining and definitely not that um, fun. So, but uh, you'll notice I made a boat uh, uh, because we seem to be surrounded by a bunch of water and I'm gonna probably head off in that direction. There's a couple blocks I'm gonna be wanting to, to go ahead and grab. Uh, we're gonna need a bunch of oak. We're gonna need a bunch of, uh, there's a jungle, hey. Um, we're going to need a bunch of spruce, uh, maybe some dark oak, but mostly spruce. If I could find a mangrove biome, that would be awesome, but it, you know, if I can't, I can't. Uh, we are going to go ahead and probably just take a little, little look-see-loo around uh, and see if we can't find ourselves something uh, to help us get the blocks that we need to build. Um, we also... Um, oh, well, there's dark oak. There's our dark oak forest. Um, so we'll probably grab some of that. Uh, but you'll also notice I have a bunch of wooden tools. So another challenge in this series is that, oh, spruce. A bunch of spruce. I'm gonna go grab that spruce. I'm actually gonna go grab that sugar cane too. A bunch of flowers. Kinda want those flowers, but they're burning. That's not good. But uh, another challenge of this series is that, you know, we have to use our builds, um, you know, as a, as, a, as a way in which we, um, gosh, that's loud. It was a little bit loud. 
Um, but we have to use our builds uh, as a way of upgrading our gear and equipment, right? So we can't just hop from wood to stone, stone to iron, and iron to uh, diamond in one episode. No, we have to give ourselves the arduous task of, you know, you know, building a, a workshop, right? So with our starter home, um, I'm going to try and build like a, an attached workshop. I think there's a, yeah, there's a lush cave down there. But I'm going to attach, uh, attach like a workshop. And once we get that workshop up and running, then we can go ahead and craft stone tools uh, as well. You know, to transition to iron, I'm going to need a blacksmith. Uh, so we will try and get that tackled maybe, maybe in the next episode. Uh, we will see. But, uh, yeah, we're going to need some iron. And I have a very, yeah, yeah, I have a very bad feeling about this. Yeah, I have a very, very bad feeling about this. I just need one, a couple spruce trees, man, a couple, and I don't, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it. I think I'm gonna get murdered by the snow, <laughs> so we're gonna have to dig all this stuff out because, uh, you know, we need to get up here. I don't want to freeze to death, uh, but yeah, we're gonna have, we're gonna need a a blacksmith for iron tools. We are going to need, uh, I think for diamond, what I want is like kind of like a magical forge. I want to kind of build that, right? So for, for diamond and netherite, you know, we need like a magical forge. You know, we need to, instead of, you know, just hopping from, um, you know, uh, our bare bones to iron, iron armor in the first episode, what we have to do is we have to... Uh, we have to build ourselves a, um, or we have to get leather armor first, right? Uh, we'll, we'll, that's purpose of the cows. So we'll get leather armor. And then once we build our blacksmith, you know, we can wear all the iron that we want. But uh, likely we are going to be wearing iron for a while until we can get the necessary prerequisites for diamond. But, uh, so it's going to add a little bit of a challenge because, again, we're going to have to survive and not die. Um so it is going to add ourselves a little bit of a challenge, but I think it'll be worth it. I think it'll be a, uh, a cool little uh, thing for us to do, right? Um, but in any case, I'm going to go ahead and gather some more resources, probably try and find like a hole to hide in because it is already night and, you know, I can tell, like I said, uh, I am just now starting off on YouTube, and I can tell trying to record and play Minecraft at the same time is definitely a challenge. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and not get murdered. Not get murdered. Get back. Get back. There we go. And we're mining some stone here. We're back towards the spawn island. I hear a skeleton and I am very afraid. Uh, so I am gathering some stone here. Um, can't quite craft the stone tools I want, but we're gonna have to grab uh, some more wood <laughs> at some point. Now I would like to add that there is going to be one exception to this, how we upgrade our stone tools uh, dealio and that is that we will be allowed to make ourselves a cobblestone uh, a furnace I believe if we do this yeah we make ourselves a smoker so we can make a smoker because we're going to need a way to actually you know cook our food because if we don't get any food, we are definitely going to die. All right, so what I think I'm going to do now is I'm going to try and find a better place to build because right now that little spawn island that we got, uh, I'm not gonna try and go too far away, but that little spawn island that we got over there, uh, there's barely any trees on it and uh, we're in desperate, desperate, desperate need of wood. So uh, 
let's go ahead and try and find ourselves some more wood. Oh, look at that. More wood. I need to check out that, uh, I need to check out that. Uh, we'll check it out. We'll check it out later. We'll check it out later. Let's, let, let's go over here, get some wood. We need a lot of this oak wood, um, and we're going to need to plant our spruce trees. Um, and then uh, I'll be back once I've collected a little bit more resources. A whole lot of tree chopping. Sunken ship. We're going to have to go check out that later. But uh, as you can see, I'm uh, heading back to that spruce area. We're going to collect a crap ton of spruce trees there too. Oh, look what I found, guys. I found some goats. Eventually, we're going to make a zoo of all the animal moms. Uh, so we will definitely need to keep in mind that these guys are here. I think that's a snow fox, too. Ooh, is there goat horn? Goat horn. Oh, that is awesome. That is awesome. Um, it's got, like, a cooldown, too. All right, cool. Yeah, yeah, we'll keep that. We'll definitely need that for our fantasy medieval city that we're going to soon be building but uh anyway i'm still chopping wood here uh i'm still chopping it with a wooden axe and you, you guys i'm sure you know how annoying and how slow a wooden axe is but we are slowly chipping away getting the uh required amount of wood for the build the all right so we are back here um Got some resources. We got like a we got the goat horn, uh, a couple flowers, uh, three stacks, almost three stacks of oak, two and a half stacks of spruce. I planted a bunch of spruce saplings that we got over there at the uh, spruce, the tiny little mountain spruce biome, and then I planted a bunch of oaks over here. Uh, the spawn is that way. I literally went back to the spawn island, came off over this direction, and then I found this little spot right here. Uh, which I think will be a suitable place for what I have planned for the overall, um, you know, build, uh, building, uh, that we're going to be doing, uh, in this area. And we're going to have a lot, a lot, a lot of builds here. We're going to have a city's worth of, uh, a build. There's going to be guilds, uh, there's going to be shops and there's going to be all sorts of craziness uh that we'll get into as the as the series pro series progresses um but uh here we are we got this little uh um we got this little uh area pa paved out here and we're gonna go ahead and build our starter home all right so i got this uh basic outline here we're really gonna have you know the the central house right here we're gonna have this cutoff right here uh, for and, and inside of it we're gonna have like a little crafting area like workshop thing and that and once we get that completed that's gonna uh, allow us to go from wood tools to stone tools and then in the center here we're gonna have a tower that shoots up there's there's gonna be like a little bit of a second floor uh, and there's gonna be a little bit of a balcony but uh, as I progress uh, you'll see a little bit more of that all right, so we have our little crafting area built. I've made a little bit of progress on the house. Again, this is just kind of like the uh, the bare, bare minimum right now, but it, it will look absolutely a whole lot better once it's all done. But uh, since we have this little crafting station finally done, I'm going to go ahead and craft our stone tools. Finally, finally, finally. I never thought I'd be so happy to see stone tools. But it's now raining. Awesome. All right, so we're here with a little update. Um, I just made a stone and andesite chimney. Um, I decided to use dark oak for the roof. Um, I went over to that dark oak biome uh, over next to the uh, spruce biome, collected a bunch of that. We got about like two or three stacks or something like that um, of it. Um, and then we also have a wheat field right here. 
So I, I started planning that so we can go ahead and get that rolling uh, because you know we're not really going to be able to water the fields until we can get an iron bucket. And to get an iron bucket, we're going to have to build a mine shaft. We're going to have to build a blacksmith so that we can use iron. So let's uh, continue on our merry way building this here build. All right, so it looks like we've got the exterior of the house pretty much done. Uh, I know I didn't really do much building with you guys this episode. I think, uh, you know, in later episodes when I get used to video recording and stuff like that, uh, I get a little bit easier going with it. Uh, I'll be able to cut in and, you know, build with you guys and, uh, and improve the video quality a lot. You know, I plan to try and, you know, throw on some time lapses and all that stuff. I just got to learn how to do it. Uh, it's going to be a great learning experience. But uh, as you can see, we got the exterior done. Um, it's, it's, it's a pretty decent starter house. Uh, I threw in a cart right here uh, for right now. It's a simple cart design. I think that, that was a FWIP. Uh, cart design uh, but uh, this wall is looking very plain I, I probably need to do something with that this wall I might even need to do a little bit more um, uh, here we have a uh, back balcony um, and then you know kind of this mirrors that we need to do some stuff right there um, we need to add some design right there uh, and and as you can tell we do not have an interior yet but one of the biggest things with my builds, guys, is I want to do all the interiors. So I want to show off the interiors. I want to do the interiors. I want to get better at building the interiors. But, uh, you know, we got this bottom floor right here uh, with the cobble and the andesite floor. And then we got this top floor, which is going to be our bedroom. Um, and then we have the balcony right here. And then we have this little ladder that leads up here. And then we have our, you know, tiny little garden flower garden so um, real quickly I'm gonna go gather some clay and some other items and kinda plan out this interior and then we'll go ahead and build it some of it together and try and practice all oh, this clay is mine it's mine alrighty let's uh, go ahead and take a couple of these campfires and then go ahead and burn our house down no we're gonna put them out Little bit of campfire action, make it look a little spruicy doocy. More um, campfires, you know? I feel like this is a fire hazard, you know? Fire right next to wheat. I feel like this thing will go up in flames. Put it out with my fire safety shovel. Flower pots now. Where do we put the flower pots? That's a good, good, good question. Where are we gonna put the flower pots? How about one right here? Oh crap, I forgot my oak saplings. Dark oak saplings and birch slapping saplings to be specific. Saplings, saplings. Let's put one right over here too. Maybe we'll do a birch right over there. Let's go find some other places where we can put these things. How about up here? How about up here? How about up here? Um, yeah, we can put a couple pot. No, we can't do the pot right there. It's not gonna, not gonna work right there, but we can do two of them right here. I think we're gonna put a lantern right here whenever we get access to iron and we make a blacksmith. We're gonna need some of this. Ooh, makes a weird noise. And we're gonna need a jungle sapling, which requires me to murder an entire tree. Uh, look at that house from the distance. One of these days, this whole hill is gonna be a sprawling city. All right, so we're going to go ahead and start on this interior by building a little shelf of sorts, I guess, kitchen shelf really what I'm imagining this thing is going to be. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Just like that. And like this, like this, like this. And we'll put 
put one of those right there. Put that right there. Okay. And then we also need something else. And I can't remember what it is. Maybe we should put the cooked salmon. I think we should put the cooked salmon there. Turn that sucker that way. I remembered what I was going to do there. I was going to put a lantern there. We are uh, eventually going to replace all of our torch lighting in here with, you know, actual, you know, lighting that's not freaking torches. Uh, but unfortunately, we're going to have to roll with the torches for now. Um, and then we will definitely, you know, get uh, the lighting replaced. But uh, let's go ahead and do this number and that number. Get us one of these guys. Boom. 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 There we go that full well kind of maybe it's a little trash can I don't know there's a table net right behind the trash can that's probably not a not a, a good thing but uh, um, what else do we need we need one of our cups and we'll place that right there and we also got ourselves a couple of smokers along with this backwards loom that kind of looks like a grill you know extra storage space we're gonna need all the storage space possible because our Inventory is looking pretty full. All right, now let's do the upstairs. All right, so we got our blue bed up in the up top. I dyed a the, my white bed that I had uh, with our blue corn flower. So we got our little bed here. But let's go ahead and do this number and this number and that number. Uh, I need my pots. I need my pots. I believe my pots are right here. Yes. Flower pots. Oop. Phone went off. Amateur move. Do that there. That there. That there. That there. And we will also do. Let's grab those chests. We're going to do. This number, that number, this next number, that number, um, that number, boom, oh, wait, hang on. There's a certain way you gotta do it. One, and two, and then also we will do, boom, 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 boom. Boom. All right, and we got ourselves a little, uh, you know, area to store these uh, wooden tools that we have used, and we are good to go for the interior of this home. So it's very basic home. It's a very small home. Uh, it's our starter home, so it's not going to be too uh, complicated. We are going to come back and touch up uh, some areas. Uh, such as uh, the lighting. We're going to replace the lighting with uh, uh, lanterns and then of course uh, maybe do some green inch like that area right there. Right there if we had some leaves just drooping down uh, I think that would be uh, a perfect place for it. So uh, just uh, keep that in mind that we will be returning to uh, just add a few minor touches in the later episodes. All right, guys, so I went ahead and built this uh, wheat field. Uh, I put, you know, some uh, coarse dirt, a little bit of a path kind of leading into the field, and then like a cobblestone wall uh, around here uh, mixed with some uh, stone and andesite. I tried uh, actually uh, recording the whole process of me, uh, uh, t you know, making this wall and, and making the wheat field, but uh, for some reason the uh, file got lost so uh you know we're just uh we're just figuring things out that's all that's all i know so uh yeah all right guys so i have this little barn um very small compact barn made um 
this is going to be where we're going to store our cows. We're going to do a little bit uh, with the floor here in a minute. And then we also got this little high arched ceiling. So it's just a, a quaint little place to, to store our, our cows. Right here would have been a good place to put uh, the back part of the barn if I would have done some terraforming. But I have I have some plans to put like a pathway up here towards like a um, you know sugar cane fields or sugar cane springs, really. Um, you know, blacksmith probably right there, and then we'll uh, we'll finish this uh, mine shaft. Uh, we're not going to do that today. Uh, we're going to finish the you know the texturing on the floor right here. You know, get get some uh, uh, fences right there, uh, or gate fences right there, and then go gather some cows, and then we will conclude this first episode. All right, I just wanted to come back and uh, give you an update. So we put a little. Uh, coarse dirt down here mixed with, mixed with some path block again these first couple projects we are going to come back to whenever we get access to more materials and spruce them up even more uh, especially their interiors uh, but we got some wheat blocks here some uh, hay bales uh, for the cows to munch on we're also going to have some water troughs um, over here whenever we get access to cauldrons and then we got some more wheat bales up here and some put out campfires, uh, fire hazards. Uh, some barrels, grindstone, uh, we've got a couple crafting tables and a little table. And then some extra storage space for leather and all sorts of stuff. So, because uh, our items are getting, you know, kind of unwildy right now. But uh, let's go ahead and gather some cows and then uh, we'll come back. You guys are definitely the droids that I'm looking for. Come here, Mr. Cow. Come on. Come, 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 come. Let me go gather you brothers real quick. And we've got baby cows, baby cows, baby cows, baby cows. All right, so I think that is a good start to the first episode. We accomplished all three of our goals. Um... Uh, again, as I get uh, more experience with YouTube, you know, we'll start building together. We'll do more builds together. We'll start uh, changing up our tactics. You know, doing time lapses and stuff like that. You know, maybe working with the replay mod and all these little key characteristics that you see in uh, Minecraft Let's Plays. But uh, we got our starter house, our wheat field, and our little cow barn it completed. Next episode, we're probably going to work on the mine shaft and perhaps the blacksmith. But uh, we are definitely going to try and get leather armor now that we have our cows next episode. But, uh, you know, this has been... Uh... There we go. We're figuring it out. We're figuring out the controls. But this has been Night Warden, and I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Uh, please like, subscribe, comment uh, if you feel that's what you want to do. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.